Hey there YouTube, it's Math Bowler. Welcome to my TTM Monday autograph recap video. Last week, the week of November 19th, 2023, I received 43 autographs from 12 people. Four of the 12 are going to be points for the Team 80s and the Battle of the Decades. So we got four points here. I'll put a little list of those in the description for you, Caleb, in the description so Caleb, you can keep track if you wish. So Going to go in the order with which I received them. I've been sending out 10 requests or more per week for quite a while. I've been TTMing for over nine years straight. And uh, here we go. First return I got was Tom Qualters signing two of two in just six days. He's a Western Pennsylvania guy, so very cool to get him. And I got him back real fast, too. Here we go. There's a point for the Team 80s. We got Vance Law. Pretty sure I have this card signed just by Vern Law as well, and I have multiples of these signed by both, so I want to get one signed by Vance, and I took care of that. He is one for free, or $5 for each additional card. So this was a 3 of 3, 14 days with a $10 donation. This is a relatively expensive week. The next one is also has a fee. He's $5 per card. This is 5 of 4 in 14 days. He also signed the index card. We have Clint Hurdle. Really enjoyed his time with the Pirates. 2023 Manager of the Year. That season was just absolutely amazing. Ended too soon, but still was great. Did a thin blue Sharpie on that. And then back to the thick blue Sharpie for the index card as well. So I got a bonus autograph. My most expensive return of the week is next. Four of three. He also signed the index card. In eight days. $30 donation. He's $10 per card. But he has some really pretty cards. That's not as beautiful as, 50, as his 55 rookie, but Camilo Pasquale, there we go. A beautiful autograph. Dang, he has a great signature. He fills up the card. He runs that autograph till it goes off the edge of the card. Best of luck, Steven. God, it's so nice. Next up, we got a point for Team 80s. 4 of 4, 18 days. We got Bob Kipper. On four cards here. Now, whenever, um, you know, at the time, I didn't know if I was on Team 80s or Team 90s. So, you know, it's going to be a couple of weeks before I deliberately have cards coming back that were sent out for the purpose of Team 80s. Next up, this is a nice one to get. Three of three, ten days. Skip Gwynn. We got him on the 70. The 71, and bam, we finished off the 69 Houston Rookie Stars card. Him and Tom Griffin. Very good. Another one that's kind of neat for a multi-year project. We have two of two from Tom, from Bob. I'm going to say his name's Chalupsa. Signed in black pen. Got the Mad Hungarian, and I believe Bob Stinson signs. That's going to him next. He also signed my autograph card. Here's a point for Team 80s, 4 of 4, 39 days. We have Mark Gubaza. Very nice. There's a starting lineup card right there. That was the main reason for sending these cards out to him. And my fourth point I'm getting back for the team this week, Gene Garber did 5 of 4, include the index card, which I don't remember him ever signing an index card before, in 52 days. This was tied for my longest return of the week. So, very nice. Thank you. Oh, the 79s are so nice. And like I said, I never remember him signing an index card before, so very nice of you. Thank you. Next up, this person's $5 per, and I don't remember him signing in black before, so I was actually a little bit disappointed, but because the blue Sharpie would pop on these vintage cards, but that's okay. 4 of 4, 10 days. $20 donation to Joe J. Got him on the 58. Oh, yeah, Vintage Beauties here. 60. 64. And the 66. And we got two more returns to show you. This is a very unconventional 3 of 3 in 18 days for Mark Johnson. He kept one of my cards but signed the index card. So, like I said, very unconventional 3 of 3. And to finish it off, another former Pirate signed 4 of 4 in 52 days. He's the other one who tied for the longest wait here. We've got three parallels. We've got the silver, Carlos Garcia. We got him on the silver signature collector's choice, a special edition collector's choice, the electric diamonds upper deck, and a playing card. So 
Very cool. Let me know in the comments below what was your favorite. I upload three videos a week, a TTM video on Monday, and an autograph and or trading card video on Wednesdays and Saturdays. I really would appreciate it if you'd like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. My favorite hobby, the Camille Pasquales. Those cards are beautiful. All right, take care, everybody.